Now, hold on just a damn minute, John. This is neither an early access game nor an old game. Correct. What is going on here? I don't know. What is going on here? That's a great question. I'm glad you asked. Uh, welcome to the Super Awesome Video Game Show. I'm Jeff. I'm John. And John, I've been ignoring Indie Friday a lot recently because yes. the indie titles and early access have all been a little meh, meh recently, right? There just hasn't really been anything like super interesting that stands out. Uh, so I figured, why don't we take a look at this, which is an indie game called Bad Blood. You know we got bad blood. Um, it used to be mad love. I mean, I was going to go with but bad. But now we got problems. Okay, you just do. Because we got bad blood. Did you do you over there. Did you, uh, did you know, Jeff, that Band-Aids uh, can't fix bullet holes? I, di I, I didn't. And I, I've realized that you say sorry just for show. Okay, I feel like you've, you're fully on in a, wor in a, in a <laughs> song that I don't know anything about. So this is a two-player fight to the death. Um... And we have uh, numerous different characters. Each one of them has their own kind of like special powers. Uh, and you'll see that this is a this is a, a two-player game. Oh wait, that's that same guy that I was playing last time. What's this? I guy? don't even have access to that guy. Armed with hunting dog. It might have been because oops, might have been because I was on him. Um, yeah, you have him. You have him. Oh, that's him right there. That's him. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the hunter. Um, I'll go with this mechanic. All right, armed with a flashbang. So the whole thing in this game is, uh, hit the A button, uh, is that you are playing on the exact same screen. So I'm over here, and you're over here, and then- Sort of the exact same screen. We go burr, 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 So now it's up to us to find and murder the ever-loving bejesus out of each other. Um, so I, I need to, part of the idea is to look at your opponent's screen yeah. to kind of- Get an idea. Oh, I know exactly where you are. So I just used my special, which is this hunting dog that's trying to find you. Now, see, you're moving a little, a little quickly, and when you move quickly, you actually knock down the. Oh shit! Aha! Ah! You knock down the grass, yes. so yes. Uh, you want to try to try to be ever so slow. I got to tell you, John, I really oh hit the A button. Uh, I really dig the art style in this game. Yeah, like um, it's pretty fantastic. Um, and as a concept, I don't know. I mean, we only just started playing it, so I'm not entirely sure how it how it's um, uh, shakes out. But uh, it seems like a fairly interesting thing. <laughs> oh, you got me. Chaos. I thought I had you. Smack I thought I, I had gotten that you. That dog is a killer, man. I'm going to start, start with dogs. Um, so, yeah, as you can see, you can't actually see the other person. You can rustle. You can rustle the grass to try to find them. Um, oh, shit. Ha-ha! Okay. Hammer your face! So there's a, uh, there's a charge attack, apparently, that will go over multiple... Over multiple, that's what the charge attack does, right? If you hold down the R, the right trigger, you can go over multiple squares to attempt to get somebody. Uh, but if you miss them, then you're very, very sleepy, very tired. So um, now there's a couple different, uh, there's a couple of different modes in this game. Ah, ha! Power attack. Um, you got me. There's a couple of different modes in here. We'll try the like aggressor one later on. But I'm trying to figure out what like her special is. It's a flashbang. Uh, probably stuns me if I get too close. If you hold it down and, and hit me with it, then it'll probably stun me, giving you an opportunity to uh, get at me a little bit faster. All right, dog. What you got? What you got, dog? I also, again, you know, I say this all the time, John. I fucking dig that soundtrack. Oh, I oh. walked right into that. Oh, schmappadoo. I walked right into that one. Did you? Yeah. Okay. Uh, all right. So let's uh, let's give that another try. Let's stick with the with this one for good old-fashioned find for the moment. So we've got, ooh, can you try time instead of rounds? Oh, uh, sure. We'll give it a shot. There's a kind of precious few. Okay, so we got Hit Woman. I didn't realize that was a lady. Yeah. Uh, we got the Hunter Guy. Uh, I'll be the Hunter Guy this time. Okay, I'll be Hit Woman. Armed with garrot and one bullet. Armed with agility and heightened senses. Has he got a gas mask on? Apparently. Apparently you just can't escape the, the fallout comparisons uh, in this particular day and age. So, I don't know. You know, this is uh, 750 I guess, on Steam right now. 
seems like the sort of thing that might be interesting for like kind of a um, like a party thing, like a party game. Uh, you realize that you only have one of those, oh, right? See, no, I didn't. It doesn't regenerate. I don't know. I don't know if it's just my computer or what, but the uh, frame rate's a little bizarre. Oh, Aha! crap! Damn it! You hold my head up. Some kind of d dog animal. Wild bullets. Um, seems pretty cool, though. Yeah. I'll kind of dig, dig what I'm seeing here. Shit. See, there's also this mechanic where you can shake the grass. Yeah. And you can kind of do that, use that if you know what you're doing. Ow, damn it. Um, yeah, you got me. <laughs> if you know what you're doing, you can shake the grass in a way so that you can see it in the corner of your opponent's screen. Oh, okay. Is that what that's for? Uh, I was kind of having a hard time figuring out exactly what that was for. Or you can you know, do it and then move away Yeah. Uh, to kind of throw off your... So you've also got on the right trigger kind of a listen. Um seems like kind of a poorer version. And you can also zoom in to try to give your opponent less uh, yeah. to go on. Which... Ah, ah shit! Damn! All right, so oh, I was, saw exactly where you were on oh, that Oh, so one. that was like one minute yeah. total for the entire game. I thought it was like maybe one, like one minute per round. All right, let's go uh, rounds... To, oh, look at that. Rounds to forever. Oh, okay, so you can choose the number of rounds that you want. Uh... And it goes up to... goes up to forever. Forever. But 50 is the top after that. All right. So let's see what we got. And then as far as timing goes... It 10 minutes. Like 10 minutes. This is kind of interesting. All right. Let's go to, let's go to five. And then let's try the other one. I'm going to try... Um, I'm going to try this guy. We're, we're going to switch off. Oh. Oh, it's fine. You can do, you can do whatever, man. I'll be the arm guy with the dog. The do that dog is a pain in the ass. Is he? Or well, the dog seems like a pain in the ass for you when I was playing as him. Um, you have to say that like this isn't like the most well animated game I've ever seen in the entire world, uh, but it is. Um, I really dig the art style. Oh shit! Damn it! Wait, I was trying for. What what is hearing? Oh no, that's like hearing hearing. Ah, oh, you got me. Eat it. Cause yeah, it, it throws you off because the the not only is it um, you're not able to see the other person, but also my board is turned. Yeah, it's in a different direction. Yeah. Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that that early on. Oh shit! There's also yeah these vines that you can get stuck on. Oops. Crap, sorry. I was trying to figure out, how was I listening before? No, ah, shit. How was I doing that, John? Doing what? The kind of listen mechanic. Uh-oh. Oh! Where I was, uh, maybe that's just something that one of the other, other hunters can do. You said left trigger, or right trigger, I mean. But right trigger is the power attack move. No, no, left trigger is the power attack move. No, left trigger is your special. Oh. Hold on. Charge attack, zoom, zoom, shake grass, attack. Wow, that's weird. Maybe it was just uh, a power that that one character had. It seems like we were both doing it, right? Um, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Ah! Yeah. I stalked you. Yeah. I stalked you. Really, like, missing an attack in this game really is uh, not super great. Um, you know, I don't know. This is the kind of thing that I really like about video games, John, is when you come across something like this uh, that is very kind of uh, very unique. Shit. Ha ha! Yep. So the dog is also good for two things. What's that? One, it points to where you are if you're nearby. Right. The opponent. Yeah. But also, it moves around and it moves the grass when it moves. Yeah. So... Sometimes you might think that you're looking at, you know, that you're standing over the person that you're supposed to be, you know, that you're supposed to be going after, but in right. actuality, it's the dog. 
Oh, shit. Aha! Damn it. I moved right in time. You did. You did. No, I like this. I like yeah. this. It seems like it might be interesting. Okay, let's try uh, Let's try this other mode. The hunting season? Yeah. Players take turns being the aggressor. Five okay, rounds. what does that mean? It seems that, I guess, it, like, sometimes... I haven't been the mechanic yet. Um, sometimes you're the prey, and sometimes... Oh, oh yeah. You're the, uh, the hunter. Call it! Who's calling it? That you're calling it. Or... Okay, never mind. I guess... You have to hit a button, John? I did hit a button. Oh. Okay. Oh. oh. I get to choose. I'll start with me, I guess. You can go first. So now my whole thing is just to hide for 30 seconds. <coughs> you got to find me, John. You going to find me? I'm going to zoom in. Uh-oh. Russell and Jimmy's. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Hide. Aha! All right. Damn it. This is hard. Yeah. I'm just out in the middle of. And I'm going to zoom in just to fuck with you. No man's land here. Damn, dude. Wait, what is that? Okay. Well, shit. Ha ha! Oh, fuck Barnes. Yeah, this is a lot harder mode. <laughs> I think two people going at one another is a little bit more, a little bit harder. I think it's a really smart idea the way that they've zoomed into the point where you can't tell what direction like your shit is rotating. Yeah, in. yeah, it's it's definitely. And I like the kind of the whole like making sure that you looking at somebody else's screen. Um, fuck that! I'm knocking down all the grass. I don't give a shit. You can't even defend against. Ah, shit! Oops, crap! That was not my intention. Wow, I feel like That's, we're uh, we're really locked in. Yeah, uh, I mean, stalemate we're, yeah, on this well, mode. Yeah. What are we up to? Go to five, I guess? Uh, uh. Kind of reminds me of, uh, like, you know what? This would have been a really interesting yeah. Assassin's Creed uh, minigame, right? Oh, yeah? Like Templar versus... Uh... Yeah. I'm stepping in all the traps over here. All right. Ass face. I can't tell which side of the map is up for you. Yeah, that that's again, that's the part that's confusing. Oh shit. Well, I don't know what that just did. Oh crap. Oh, okay. So if you hold down power attack but you don't actually pull it in a direction, that's how you uh listen. Okay. I think we should go back to one of the other modes. Okay. We've gotten a, a kill. I don't actually know how though how to get out of this. Ah, there we go. Boom. You're welcome. Yeah, thank you, John. All right, let's do this again. Boom. Go on, mechanic. Bad. We're bad at at sussing out the details when it's not just trying to immediately murder each other. Yeah. I guess it's really important to pay attention at the very beginning where it rotates your screen. So up for you is right for me, I guess. Oh, okay, it shows you. That's why that whole thing is there. Seriously, I really love the music for this game. <laughs> ah, bam! I'm trying to use, figure out how to use my gun. So you hold it down, press in a direction, and then let it go, and it'll shoot down that, well, down that direction. That's what I did. Yeah. And it didn't. Like either that, really or you got to me too quickly. Tell how finicky the uh, the. Uh, <laughs> Tell how finicky the th shit is. Oh, I see you. No, um, figured it out. 
Oh, uh, that kind of sucks. Have to hit they a. don't have a. Oh, yeah. okay. You have to, so you aim and then you hit A to yeah to go. Do the attack. So does that mean that this? Oh shit! Oh, interesting. I feel like it's a like a trap. Yeah. Damn. Good soundtrack. Uh, yeah, I really want to find out who did the soundtrack. Oh, oh, oh shit. Well, Once I figured that out, that gave me an unfair advantage. <laughs> um, what, the gun? Yeah. I feel like it's kind of an unfair advantage. Oh, I don't know. I got my own advantages. How does this thing even work? I'm trying to figure out how this flashbang works. Is it... I have to hold this down. Sorry. Ah, okay. Whoa. Oh, Aha! Oh. Flashbang! Oh, shit. Damn it! Ah! <laughs> I couldn't find you. Because I moved. I should have rustled. The thing is, you can still move. You just can't see where you are. Oh. So I immediately was like, well, shit, if I All stay right. here. Yeah. Damn right, if you stay there. Shit, John, you're whooping my ass this time. Uh, let's just remember who whooped whose ass last time as well. Is that you? Yeah. you just I the will... most ass whoopingest uh, I, I jungle am. man of all time. Oh, shit. Oh! <laughs> Nicely done, sir. I didn't think I was gonna. I didn't think I was gonna. Oh, okay, so that's weird that it, it didn't. Did it really say that you won? No, no, it said you won. Oh. Did I win? Yeah. No, because you got like four kills. I got like two. Oh, okay. Um, all right, let's, let's try this. Best again. of five, so yeah, I guess. Huh. I. Oh, I guess, yeah, you should have won. Let's see. Hunter, kid, I'm gonna go mechanic, with and kid hit again. woman. <clears throat> kind of reminds me, in a weird way, stylistically, of Hotline Miami, but I don't know why. Like, it has kind of a hotline Miami style. I mean, it's just the kind of color and the way that the the music is. Yeah. So. Well, John, this week, uh, last week was all Fallout. This week is probably going to be all Star Wars. Are you ready for all Star Wars? Um. Yeah, Are you ready sure. for Battlefront? Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. I got stepped into ah. Blah, I knew blah. where you were. So I guess I mean I'm not gonna be buying it, so you know there's yeah. that. And it's not because I don't like it or whatever. It's just that they don't interest me. Yeah. Um. Do you so. think that if it had a single player campaign that it would interest you? A little bit. More. Oh god damn. Yeah, probably. You gotten really good at this game. Well, that's because I I I realized it told you where I was, and then I was just waiting for you to get into the square so I could kill you. I need to spend more time looking at your screen or kind of memorizing the map, I guess. Oh, I don't memorize jack shit. Ah, shit. Dog that, that gave dog me your location. Is, that dog is a killer. Man. Ah, oh, crap. The idea that this is a kid is kind of disturbing. Ah, oh, damn it. Shit. Damn it. Ha ha! Ah, you sack of crap. You sack of crap. I hate this kid. I want to be somebody else. It's the computer's right, bring fault. Bring my dog back out. I like the fact that they've got, like, the person's uh, weapon of choice is highlighted. Um, ah, shit. Ah! No! It's like, why won't you stab him? <laughs> yes! So, yeah, five out of five. It, oh, okay, so is it whoever's got the red weapon yeah. on this screen is yeah. the one that wins? Okay. That's a little bit more stylistic than I think maybe entirely necessary. Well, shit, uh, what's our time looking like? We've kind of gone over everything that's in here. Oh, Okay. Let's see here. Oh, okay. So we got ten more minutes. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna try to get try to get better at this game. I'm gonna be this hit woman again. All right. 
see if I can't can't get at you a little bit. Be the mechanic. Two ladies. Yep. So yeah, um, I I mean you know, John, we've been looking up at all the the early access stuff that's been coming out. Yeah. It's it's kind of like I feel like I feel like Steam is starting to lose some of its cachet, right? Like. I feel like, as far uh, as the early access stuff goes, I feel like Steam, when they did the big reorganization of how... When they did the big reorganization on how everything's supposed to look, yeah. or that, you know how everything is displayed, yeah. I feel like they kind of fucked over a lot of things. Yeah. I just, I guess it's like, it just seems, I mean, I think that you were mentioning this, I don't know if it was on a podcast or somewhere that like, it used to be that you could, you could be kind of assured that Steam, like, that the stuff that was released on Steam was interesting at least, right? Kind of had yeah. your back. Um, and now it just feels like, like a lot of just kind of shovelware. And I'm kind of worried because it almost feels like, um... It almost feels like, um, like we were losing, uh, like, I, okay, I'm sorry, I'm not doing a good job of expressing myself here because you're trying to murder yeah. me with a shovel or a hammer. Um, <clears throat> ah, you got me. Power attack! Um, that, uh... The like the, at least the PC game industry. I mean, like I don't know what the sales are like for indie developers these days, but I would imagine they're starting to get real burned out. I mean, there's just like, like there's literally a limit. I mean, you could have a PlayStation Four and you could kind of play a fair amount of the games that the PS Four has to offer, but like Jesus, man, the Xbox uh, or the uh, PC store is just starting to get like so overbloated. Ah, shit. Gotcha. Um. So bloated with stuff. I mean, well, you know, this game is cool, but like, you know, there were, I was looking at some of the other stuff that came out. It's just fucking horrible. Well, like, it's like my problem with early access is that they do oh popular new releases or or you know or what is the most popular game. They don't actually have a list for new releases. Right. Like, oh, shit. It, it's basically <laughs> well done, sir. Um, but yeah, they don't actually have a thing that that lists all of the new releases because there are tons. There, every week goes by that I'm like, the, I, when was when did that game come out? It came out last week on early access. Whoa, when it's not on the new releases list. What the fuck? Right. You know, kind of thing because because it's popular new releases, right, and not new releases. But I mean, I just feel like even if you go to the all games where you can see literally every game, you can't that's do that out, for early access, though. Well, you uh, the, they still are listed in the in the all games list, right? But like even just looking at the all games list, like man, there's just there's so much there's so much fucking trash in there. Like there there's is. just so many things that come out that like I just have no interest in playing at all, at all. Um, and I, I feel like that this is becoming a, a pretty serious problem because they're just choking. They're, ch they're literally choking the industry with... Um, they're literally choking the industry with garbage. <laughs> Aw. I shot it. Oh, well, that was smart. Ah, and then I you got, got you me. with the garrot. Yeah, oh, you got bitch. good with that. Blah, 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 blah. That was good. Yeah. Uh, okay. So yeah, I don't know. Like, I feel like, like I'm of two minds about it, John. Because in some cases, I feel like, like I never want to take away the, I never want to take away the possibility for an indie developer to get their product out there, right? Yeah. On the other hand, Jesus, man, there just needs to be fewer games. Like, or I don't know. Maybe that's, I mean, you know, a lot of times we get in these situations where the shit that I'm talking about or the my opinion on stuff is very colored by the fact of somebody who looks at all this stuff. Yeah. Maybe the casual observer, it's not that bad. I mean, you're you're a little bit more casual about it than I am. I mean, you're mostly focusing on early access. Oh, shit. Ah, you got me. I got a little bit. I thought I shot you. Uh, okay. 
I got a little bit of. <coughs> um, I got a little bit of uh, overzealous there. Okay. Uh, at the end there. So I'm going to keep trying some of these people. Let me try the mechanic again. Um, I wish. I mean, I do wish this game kind of had more characters. Yeah, or maybe like the ability to have a larger stage. It's obviously that the stages are are procedurally generated, right? Yeah. Um, it would maybe be interesting if there was a little bit more of a, a landmarks. Um, <laughs> Damn. Ah, you got me. Well done, sir. Yep. I, I it's pretty it's pretty ingenious though, man. Yeah. Just the idea of turning your screen to the point where it's not like it's it's, it's not disorienting. One one. Yeah, yeah it's, it is a little disorienting and not super apparent. Um and the kind of the slowness at which you've got to move. <laughs> You're like back and forth, back and ah, forth. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, it's it's very ingenious. It's it's, and while I wouldn't say it's, I mean, it's very much a game in the same vein, but it's not the same game at all. Yeah, uh, it's very kind of reminiscent of Nidhogg, just not as, yeah, or kind not of as uh, samurai gunish a little yeah, bit. Yeah, samurai gunish, just not as. Uh, oh, dude, damn. what are you doing? It's running up on me, man. <laughs> uh oh, getting close to a shutout, John. That's okay. I got a shutout on you once. So. Yeah. Um. There is part of me that's really interested in doing. Uh. Keep calm. Oh. Yep. And nobody explodes. Yeah. Uh. But I've been kind of saving that for, like, I just want to you know kind of do something real special with that. Damn, there's a lot of shit around here. Oh, fuck you then. Uh oh. What? Nothing. I just... It's kind of hard to gauge when you're going to end up moving quickly. Yeah, that is probably the hardest thing, I think, is that... Fuck. Aha! You Hammer! Me after I missed. That was good. That was Hammer good. face! Hammer time! I didn't realize you moved. <laughs> so... Um... All right, let's... I feel it's a little bit... This game is a little bit more, like, we're fr less frantic... Than like Nidhogg? Yes, definitely. And also, so there's less less chance of ruining a, a friendship. <laughs> I don't. Think you know what? I'm curious on something. Yeah. You do. Oh, you can't choose the same character. Oh, you can't choose the same character. Interesting. Okay, I was gonna I was gonna basically do let's do the like dogs on dogs. Yeah. I was yep. gonna see. Let's see how that goes. Um. Yeah. So I don't know. Here's a here's a here's a question, John. Is, um, what do you think that Steam could do to fix? their problem of, of just stupid amounts of releases. I honestly don't know. I mean, like I like I said, I would never want to really tell a developer that you can't, you know, you, oh, well, you can't release your game because the market is too well, saturated. On the other hand, uh-oh. Well, I also, I do feel that, uh, I do feel that, ah, oh, damn it. I do feel that Steam dog needs is OP. To, uh, again, I'm speaking purely from an a, from an early access standpoint. Right. Um, I think that they need to f stop with the here's the most popular of the new releases because that's fucking bullshit when it comes to early access. I mean, I guess the, the real question is like on their main page, right, where they display most of the content that you're going to end up seeing. Yeah, but if um, I'm, again, if I'm going there for for early access, that doesn't help me. No, because I, there is no way to display every early access game that's been released. I guess what I'm saying is, if they are going to be displaying, like I don't understand why, um, like they seem to value categories more than they value. Um, oh shit! God damn it! They seem to value categories more than they value. Um, Oh, ah, is that you? Oh, no, did you move you into the me. square? Yeah, uh, you got okay. me. Um, they seem to value categories more than they value. Like, I, I think that if you took like a lot of the shit 
that was like enthusiast kind of like indie titles and stuff. And you just put it away on a different page. I know, and I know, and I'm real sorry, because even like this game, right? There's a good chance that the people who made this game might end up failing. On the other hand, I really don't think that we're doing ourselves any favor. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> kind of just snuck up on me there. Yep. Um, what? In this game, you snuck up on me, John, you, you horse shit. Um, oh, that's some bullshit. Yeah. I ran into one of those. Like, like I have earlier. no way of not running into that because this entire area is blocked off. God damn it. <laughs> ah, ah well power done. attack. Well uh, done on the power attack. You're getting used to those. Yep. So, but yeah, I guess that's one of those things where it's like a weird, like Steam doesn't, Steam doesn't want to have to be a content they don't want to have to um, uh, what, curate their content, right? They kind of want to let like stuff like green light. They kind of want to let the community do it for them. But I think it's safe to say that like that is just not working. Yeah. Like, and the longer this shit goes on, I feel like the more devalued all games get. Um, oh, calling my dogs. All right. What's our uh, what's our time looking like over there? Okay, so we're we're done. I don't know, folks. Let us know in the comments maybe what you think about um, about this whole problem. Yeah, uh, I'm interested to know. Oh, can you hit your button? Um, I'll just go back in real fast and. Uh, um, <clears throat> uh, I'm interested to know kind of what you guys think, and if you guys if it's even a problem. Maybe it's not a problem. Maybe people who have, you know, PCs they enjoy having that amount of shit to sift through. Yeah. Um, I just think that it's very much diluting things that otherwise I might end up seeing. Yeah. Um, and, and as far, again, going to the early access discussion. Oh, shit. Fuck. Ha -ha! Damn. I was just too aggressive. I actually, too I'm going to be honest, that was pure luck. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, go down in the comments. Let us know what you think. Uh, I'd be interested. Like, do you think that it's a problem even the way that it is? Or am I just complaining pantsing too much? Uh, that's, that's, ah, shit. That's very much happened before, John, yeah. where I've just been too much of a, of a doctor complaining pants. Uh, also, like and subscribe. Uh, let us know what you think about this game. Hey, if you like this game, it's seven fifty. There should be an Amazon link, but there should not be any Amazon links. But, hey, if you want to buy it, uh, more power to you. Because this seems like the sort of thing yeah. that, if you got a friend to hang around with, yeah, I don't kind of fun. I could totally see us doing this on a on a like a rage cast. Oh, or, oh you got me! Rawr, rawr, like on a rage cast or something. You yeah. Know. Uh, so yeah. Uh, also, you can get into the comments and let us know. I mean, you know, if we don't have anything to look at on Super Awesome Video Game Show, um, you know, before we've looked at some like kind of unknown classics, but that required a little bit more preparation this week than we really had. So let us know what you think um, and what you feel and how you feel about what you think and how you think about what you feel. Um, and we will catch you all next week for another... Uh-oh, too tired. No! Not a hammer in the face, John! Ah, blah, 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 blah. Okay, we got one more. We'll just finish up on this. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, like and subscribe, YouTube channel, thumbs up, tell your friends, tell your nana, uh, tell all... You tell your principal. Um, oh, no! Oh, ouch, ouch, ouch! Gotta get out of... Ah! John got me with the hammer! We'll see you next week, folks! Hammer time!